Welcome back everyone, and we're back in the bathroom. So today we are going to be uh, replacing some sinks. Let me show you what we got going on here. Okay, so here's our normal basic vanity. The problem we have is the sinks are so kind of narrow and stuff that every time we use them, we've got two, every time we use them, the water just splashes out everywhere. So we got some of the countertop sinks, the ones that go on top of everything. What are they called? Vessel sinks. Vessel sinks and new faucets. So we're going to replace all that. We're going to pull these sinks out and um, yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so we're under the sink and the sinks are being held on by those um, clips. clips. And we've got two over there, two over there. We'll have to disconnect that. And then we'll eventually disconnect that. But let's pull the sink out first and that way it'll uh, not be in our way because it's kind of a pain. Okay, so we got the clips off from underneath and um, the sink is still hanging on there. So I'm pretty sure there's some sort of uh, caulking adhesive or something like that holding it. So I'm gonna take the box cutter and see if I can cut around the edge and remove any potential adhesive. And Travis is holding it from underneath so that if it suddenly gives way I won't just uh, come crashing down. Well, we've spent almost two hours messing with this. And so I think we've come to the conclusion we're just gonna break them. Yep, just break them. Okay. I was gonna try to sell them, or see if anybody needed them, but at this point, there's no way. I mean, <laughs> you can't spend four days trying to get the things out without no. breaking them, so. So we have this top part that we don't want to break, but the sink is not connected to that, it's just silicone to it. Hopefully when we break it, we'll be able to get some leverage and um, peel it off. Peel it off. <sighs> this could go horribly wrong. I know, where's my safety glasses? It could all have gone horribly wrong at any moment. I know. So, um, let's just try to Get it out with the least effort. Okay. Oh, these safety glasses are horrible. I know, that's why I got these. <laughs> They're less horrible. All right, let's see if we can position you guys for you guys to see this better. All right, people, here we go. Um, 
What do you think? I got this. Do you think we should like try to? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I maybe do maybe that. Try. Okay, you could try it. Chipping it. <laughs> Do you know it was hollow? Hmm? Oh, I figured it was hollow. For the water to run down here mm -hmm. and into that. That's why it's got that bell. Yep. Get out of the way and let her vacuum. Oh wait, no, I need to get that. Uh, I'm gonna let her vacuum first, then I'll get that. Get what? There's a piece on the underside of here. Oh. Don't rub your fingers along the underside. I will not rub my fingers here. I'll let you take that out of the way. Maybe empty it. Kind of stinky and kind of heavy. out, seeing cleaned off, all of the uh, shards have been picked up, so now I need to take this off, and I brought in a crescent wrench, it would be a heck of a lot easier to do it this way than from underneath. Houston, I think we need more pieces. This is nice and hefty. Wow. It is, I know. It's solid. Should have used this to break the sink. <laughs> no, our luck, we would have damaged that. What do we got? Stats and bobs. Pieces and parts. Bobs. Pieces of parts. Supposed to know where all these pieces go, or are there destructions? Um, here are the destructions, such as they are. They gave us these, but I don't know if these are any Those better. Those have to screw into these. Okay. So we'll go ahead and take these off.
Let's go get a sink. What do you guys think? Pretty cool, huh? For me? Yeah, you're the one that was like, ooh, maybe we can have a little taller sink. Is that tall enough for you? You like it? That should be good. This was not my idea. No, but you were on board with it because it was going to make the sink taller. And you wanted a taller sink. That should be good, right? All right, we got some caulk that's gonna work, I think. Um, it's this Lexel stuff. It's pretty good. So, let's... It's dripping. Yeah, might just be the pressure. Yeah. So I think because this is the most raised part, which I think it's raised even a little higher than that. I mean, we could do it around both. What we should do a bead here and maybe a bead there. What do you think? I think that sounds fine. Okay. Yeah, that's probably got a little plug in it from the dried out part. How big of a bead do you want? Doesn't have to be a big bead. Yeah, I probably need to cut some of that off, that tip. I'm uh, just now that all the caulk's there, I'm wondering how am I gonna hold on to it to flip it? I'm gonna have oh, to. Oh, you gotta put it in, your fingers in the hole, Dave. That's a smart idea. Why didn't I think of that? Because 
on okay. your genius wife. Okay, go toward the wall a little bit more. Oh, crap, I stuck. Okay. All right. Out there? Yep. That's not as close as we had it before, but that's okay. Well, it can come this way. No, I mean, it's not as far back as we had it oh. before. How's that look? How is it uh, up here? It's not straight. Everybody. So this is the next day actually from uh, when we started the project and I got the sink um, around the edge of it caulked and a little bit of caulk around the um, drain stopper and we got that installed. We had the last little bit that we had to do was finish the plumbing underneath the cabinet and so we're going to finish that up. Travis went and got the pieces and parts um, from the hardware store on the way home from work and so we're going to finish at least one sink up real, right quick and uh, see if we can get it done. You ready? Yep. All right. Let's go under the sink. All right, let me see if I can get a good angle here. So we need to connect that up to technically the black one. I've got this one on there because I was wanting to see how much room I had. But I'm going to pull that off and see if the 12 inch long extension I got will fit. So, you want the inch and a half? Which way to unscrew? sinks and bathrooms. That's always weird to me. So that could, yeah, that's not gonna. So that'll fit down, but I am gonna need that other one on there. You guys can see that there's a little bit of a gap. I don't think I can fudge it. It's like exactly the right length. So we will get the other one back on there. Trying to get a shot of it, but I think I just 
nips getting your your hand. have a longer one than 12 inches at the store, so. I thought you were going to get one of those flexible ones. I don't like those flexible ones, mostly. So, um, let's see. to go from inch and a quarter to inch and a half. That's what this one is. Notice that problem? I gotta put this on it here. Cut first, washer second. it might leak is right here or here because that's where water sits okay. before it comes and leaves. Well, should I run some water? You should run some water. You sure? Are you, I'm very sure. Okay. I'll watch it down here. Here we go. Let's see. Okay, so I'm on the floor of the bathroom and I'm gonna have to pull this all completely apart so that we can get to, let me see if I can show you guys. This piece right here. Uh, I gotta move the camera. So it's leaking between this piece and this piece. So we need to pull this apart, put some plumber's tape on it, and then put it back together. I think I can just take this whole assembly out and then I can um, just like, bring the whole thing down. Okay. Just think, when we do the other one, we'll have this all figured out. That's right. We're just gonna bust it out. Just like that. And done. Yep, just like that. because you over tightened it. Maybe it leaked because it's stupid. <laughs> we'll just call that good. Let's see what happens. 
I'm gonna put tape on this too. Normally we don't put tape on plastic. But I think we had a problem with this leaking the first time, so we put some tape on it and that fixed it. seal that or we might actually just replace the drain uh, from the sink with the old drain which we know doesn't leak um, so we'll try that but for now I think we're gonna call it good we'll mess with this when we start doing the other sink so from under the sink bye for now see you later please like and subscribe <laughs>